Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, we're going to talk about how to recover deleted or lost files in Windows 11 24H2 in 2025. And in this video, we're going to use a very good software, which is called Eases Data Recovery Wizard. This is a tool or a software that can help you recover files even for free. But of course, you have a limit that allows you to see whether it's worth it or not to use it to recover your lost files. Of course, files can be lost in different ways. Maybe you delete something from a USB drive by mistake, or there are some corrupted files inside Windows. Whatever the case, this software will help you recover those files. And of course, there are different factors of the issue, but we're going to discuss everything in this video. First of all, when you open up the software for the first time, you're going to see that it has a very nice interface. What I like about it is that it has a dark mode. So I'm a huge fan of dark mode in every app and this app has it. Of course, you have some simple settings that you can customize. For example, you can change the theme. And you can see other information about the software if you want. But other than that, the software is really intuitive it only has a few options and a few settings because this is everything that you need as you can see we have here data recovery and we can select here a location to search for lost data we can search for lost data inside a partition or a specific location also we have advanced recovery for SD cards NAS Linux RAID and also crashed PC if we need it but in this video we're gonna focus on the hardware disk data recovery in this case I'm just gonna select desktop and then I'm gonna click on search for lost data as you can see the scan will start it will start to find files both files that have been lost by a mistake deleted by a mistake or files that have been intentionally deleted and of course you can select which files you want to recover you're gonna see that the software will categorize all the files really good in order for you to be able to recover your files really easily in my case I'm gonna stop the scan here I'm gonna click on the stop button and I'm gonna click on stop as you can see it already found 93,000 files I'm gonna click on stop and now as you can see it's gonna organize the files that it found of course, you have the button recover all, but I don't recommend using it because of course, there are a lot of temporary files that have been recovered and so on. As you can see, we also have 62,000 files that are unimportant and we have files that have been reconstructed. We have archives, audio, documents, emails, pictures, and videos. For example, let's try to recover a picture and we also have the pictures categorized by their file extension. You also have here up top a filter that you can use. You can select the file type, the date modified, the file size, and also an advanced filter. You may be asking, well, what are the chances of me recovering a file using this software? Well, the chances highly depend on how much time has it passed since you deleted or lost that file and what file type you lost because, of course, videos will be harder to recover than text files, for example, or images. Of course, videos can be recovered, but sometimes they will be partially recovered as a corrupted file. Of course, if you recently deleted those files, the chances are pretty high that you will be able to recover those. Now, let's select an extension here. I'm going to select the extension JPEG because this is the main image extension let's say and let's select an image of course if you have the full version you can also see previews of this app but I'm gonna select a file and then I'm gonna click on recover to show you how easily you can recover a file of course it is not recommended to recover a file directly where you lost it but for the purpose of this video I'm just gonna save it on the desktop even though it is not recommended as you can see it also warns us because we are recovering files to the same drive where we lost them but in this case I'm just gonna click on continue and and this is how easily we recovered this file. This is a image that I've deleted maybe a while ago. I'm not sure, but we recovered it successfully using the software Eases Data Recovery Wizard. And then you can go around and see all the images, all the files they want to recover and select them one by one or select multiple files and recover them. As I've said, the software also provides some additional help for people that are unable to find their hard drive. And then it's going to help you do certain things using a USB drive to be able to detect those hard drives. And of course, as I've said, you can also connect SD card, a NAS, Linux RAID, and also recover a crashed PC. Recovering a crashed PC will imply that you create a bootable USB drive with a small tool based on Linux that this software provides, and it will help you recover your computer and then reinstall Windows if the problems are pretty big. So this is how easily you can recover files or fix a crashed PC using Eases Data Recovery Wizard. For more information, you can check out the description below if you want to check out the software for yourself, and make sure to try it today if you have lost files or access accidentally deleted files. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Jumani from TechBase, until next time, have a nice day.